Hi everybody, my name is Dana Clark and I am with the Nordine Technical Service Department here again today with another quick technical tip for you. You know, one of the easiest and really one of the first and most important steps that you may consider when you are performing service work on a gas furnace is this. With the power off, disconnect the R and the W terminals off of the circuit control board. Take a high quality jumper wire and then simply place it between those two terminals. Jump R and W together on the board. What this allows you to do is immediately eliminate the thermostat wiring and the thermostat out of the equation or off the table of possibilities of what could be possibly causing you a problem. This also allows you control remotely right at the furnace when you are conducting your troubleshooting. So many of today's modern gas furnaces, heating and air conditioning condensers are being controlled by digital thermostats that have a factory delay built into them. That factory delay can usually be upwards of five minutes. That five minutes will feel like an eternity if you are constantly waiting for that delay to expire before the furnace will start for you. This is one of the easiest ways that you can eliminate that problem. But very often, you'll get a report of a furnace that's not operating correctly, remove R&W off the board, jump R&W together on the board, reapply power, and the furnace takes off and works the way that it should every single time. Right off the bat, you've already discovered what your problem is. It's either in your thermostat or your thermostat wiring. Be certain to have a good jumper that you can use to eliminate that circuit and the thermostat and remotely control your furnace right there while you are performing your, your service and your troubleshooting. Thanks again for watching. Be sure that you check back here often for more quick technical tips.